Well, police knew that there had been a shooting at the school even before the 911 calls came pouring in. All units in Dallas County. We've got an active Sears activation at Perry High School. Active Sears activation at Perry High School. It's going to be in reference to a possible gunshots, possible gunshots at Perry High School starting that way. The Sears activation immediately notified police, allowing officers to access cameras from inside the school, giving them a real-time look at what was unfolding. We go back to, uh, live now to Perry and find WHO 13's Amanda Krenz there. Amanda, this alert was critical for police. And Andy, I don't think you can understate that. We are here at the Perry Police Department tonight where, again, that alert was in fact critical in getting law enforcement to Perry High School just as quickly as possible. It was also simply the push of a button that sent the whole emergency response into action. Dallas County Schools, again, have what's called this Sears system. They have had this for a few years, and it's specific to their school district. It's a school emergency response system. That's what it stands for. And the superintendent of Perry Schools, again, in that press conference that happened just a little while ago, explained how that system was activated yesterday. We hit that Sears button. Uh, I think Mr. Snowgren, if I'm not mistaken, associate principal uh, went in. That got pressed right away. And I think it was within seven minutes of getting the button pushed that we had law enforcement there. And soon after that, we had over uh, about 150 law enforcement um, and ambulance, any, uh, you know, kind of service that we that we needed. Uh, so it was it was critical and for sure it uh, I think it's still another way that we were able to save lives. And in addition to alerting law enforcement, that SEER system also alerts nearby schools so that everyone in the school district in that particular school district can kind of go into that mode of their emergency response. And even though the SEER system is unique to Dallas County, Andy, actually 90% of school districts in Iowa have similar radio emergency alert systems in place thanks to some federal money that came in last year. Well, it seems like some proof there that that system uh, is useful in the right situation. Thank you, Amanda, for that report.